Tonight's video is sponsored by Raycon. I have been personally using their latest and greatest model, the E25 wireless earbuds, for about a month now. Not only do I look incredible wearing them, but the rich sound quality and bass these provide have me reaching for them time and time again. In the box of your E25 earbuds, you're going to find the carrying and charging case. This case will charge your earbuds up to four times on a single charge. Of course, you're going to find a left and right wireless earbud and the cherry on top. They include a wide range of different sized earbud tips so that you can find the perfect fit for you. Although I might add the tips that came on them fit me perfectly fine. What makes the E25 earbuds even better is how easy they are to pair to your Bluetooth devices and you can enjoy them for up to six hours of playtime. Their compact design gives you a nice noise isolating fit. Of course, you can be cool like me and get the blue ones, but they offer other colors to choose from. Now, I know what you're thinking, Raffi, how much do awesome earbuds like this cost? $1 million, $2 million, that's where you will be pleasantly surprised. The Raycon earbuds come in at about half the price of any other premium wireless earbuds on the market. So if you click the link in the description box, you'll get 15% off of your order. So not only do you get some really awesome earbuds at an awesome price, but you also directly support the channel, and that definitely goes a long way. So thank you everyone for your continued support, and thank you very much Raycon for supporting my channel and supporting the ASMR community. Thank you very much, and enjoy tonight's video. Bye. Welcome back. So tonight, we are going to take a more gentle approach. We are going to be a little more careful with our tapping, with our sounds. I was uh, watching our previous videos, our most recent previous videos, and it's just my style, but I tend to be a little on the aggressive side with the sounds, and that's fine. That's the kind of videos that I like the most, but every once in a while, it's good to change. It's good to change up the pattern and try a different approach. Let's get some separation, let's get some separation, let's get some separation. Without any further ado, let's go ahead and introduce the participants of tonight's video. First item that we're going to play with, and I'll just do a quick intro and then we'll get into the actual sounds. So I just want to show you really quick. We have the big red box. Excellent, excellent item for some tapping, gentle tapping. The outside, this was sent in by Michael. He sent this in to the P.O. box. Thank you very much, Michael. So. the slightly different sounds. The bottom A 
makes slightly different sounds, so there's some goodies on the inside that we'll play with as well. Okay, okay, I feel good about that. I feel good about that. We have some wooden toast. These are little wood blocks, and they're in the shape of toast. And uh, you actually can't really tell, but they're actually Velcroed together. So there's a little bit of space in between them. Also sent in by Michael. Thank you, Michael. That's a nice new item. And we'll make some gentle tapping. Remember, Raffi, you have to be gentle. You have to be gentle. Okay. Next up, next up, I think one of the best things for uh, gentle tapping are screens, phone screens. screens, large screens, so I thought that this would make great sounds. I have my Nintendo Switch, Nintendo Switch here. Remember, Raffi, you must be gentle, you must be gentle, Raffi, remember, you must, must, must be gentle. Here we go. switch makes a good sound, makes good sound, so this is actually a chapstick, but it's in a case here. It's in a case, and it is able to shake around in there.
remember Rafi, let's be gentle, let's be gentle, let's be gentle. Let's be gentle, let's be gentle. Let's be gentle. Maybe we can do some stipples. Some stipple, stipple, stipple. Stipple, stipple, stipple. Separation. Boom. Autofocus. Boom. I'm a pro at using all this equipment now. I'm focusing. Do you guys remember when I first came back? I don't know how long it was at this point. I'm talking about earlier this year. <laughs> and I'm like all the way back there. I'm like half the screen. The autofocus is going. What was that? Fun. The fun sound assortment video. What a mess. That video was a mess. It was fun to make, though. It was my first, actually, it was my first video in this recording space. Okay. Zipper the snake. Zipper the snake. So we'll play around with him and enjoy the sounds that he makes. So he will be returning. He is a returning participant. Um, I think I've only used him in one video, though. Maybe two. Okay, so the goal with tonight's video, a reminder to myself, is to be gentle. We want to be calming, we want to be relaxing, we want to take it easy, tone it down a little bit for tonight, and enjoy the gentle sounds that these items make. Quite nice, actually. Mm -hmm. 
inside fruit fruit we got a little banana This is an apple, sorry. The red apple.
here makes good sounds. in here. Oh, 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 almost dropped it, almost dropped it, but I saved it. Nice. I think the red box makes good sounds. just one piece of toast just to start us off oh wow that is very nice good scratching sounds. Let me try to get another piece of toast here.
that makes really good sounds. The toast makes really good sounds. I have to remember. Gotta keep it gentle. Here we go, here we go. makes good sounds. The toast, not the case. What am I talking about? Let's make sure I'm in focus here. I don't know, every time I look at the viewfinder, it looks like I'm kind of out of focus.
nice sounds. Would love some feedback. I don't know why, but I feel like I'm not being gentle enough. Let me know if we have to revisit this video and go even gentler. I feel like it's going to take even more concentration to be gentle. I'm not totally happy with how gentle I'm being in this video. I'm trying, but it's just... I have to try again. So, we'll probably revisit this concept again. And go extra gentle. I feel like to go gentle, I have to be sitting down right now in this. When I stand up, I feel like... I get a little more aggressive with how I handle the items. Maybe if I'm sitting down, I can relax a little more. Although, for sure though, I am being more gentle than I usually am. The gentle makes good sounds. Okay, so we got the big fruit red box, the red box and the fruit. We got the toast next up. Next up, let's do the tingly chapstick. Let's try this. I want to do some stipples with it, so I'm going to move these forward. I'm going to move these forward. I'm going to refocus on my face. Here we go. Now we're talking. can show you what we're working with here. Focus on me here. There we go. Whoa, almost dropped that. <laughs> I hope you saw that on camera. That was actually pretty cool. Okay.
good or Olivia's lips don't smell good. <laughs> don't tell her I said that. Yeah. The chapstick itself doesn't make good sounds. Let's put it back in there. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go. sounds that way so we have to try again here oh there we go the cap wasn't on all the way go to sleep just relax yourself and enjoy the gentle tapping stipple sounds shall use the Nintendo Switch. Um, how am I looking? Good as ever. Okay. I have 
for the Switch are Super Smash Brothers. I'm pretty good at Super Smash Brothers. Uh, I haven't played too much of this one, but I've always played Super Smash Melee, and I'm pretty good at it. I use Falco. It's been a while since I've played as Falco, the right character I'm thinking of, the bird. The fox look-alike. I haven't had a chance to play the new one too much since I got the Switch. I've been playing The Witcher 3 on this. I'm about, uh, about 15 hours into it. It's very nice. I also have Mario Party. I also have Mario Kart. And I think that's it. I might have one more game, I can't remember. sometimes but this is a gentle video we must be gentle we must be gentle As you can see, I have a ring light above, and then I have a red light to the side to kind of give me some color on my face. And then, of course, the blue lights in the back. My setup has improved so much over the last six months. I've gotten a lot of new equipment, and I'm in love with this camera, even though at first I was not in love because of the auto issues, but as soon as I just took it out of autofocus, it worked right. I'm going to ramble a little bit now. Uh, what else have I gotten? Oh, I got a green screen, but the thing was broken, the stand for it. So I have to order a new stand, but I did get a green screen, so that would be interesting to see what we can come up with green screen wise. I want to play more games too. People liked the Red Dead Redemption video. Not everyone liked it, but I think enough people liked it that I can make another one. I also want to play other games too. is to one day get to the point where I can uh, stream on Twitch. I don't know much about Twitch, but it seems fun. I know people do ASMR on Twitch, but uh, it's a little intimidating because it's like a whole new world. But I kind of like the idea of doing live ASMR. I don't know. We'll try it eventually. I'm very... I hope you don't mind me rambling a little bit. I'm very, uh... It takes
takes me a minute before I can move on to something else. I need to fully digest what I'm doing in front of me. So I feel like I'm not fully established on YouTube yet. It's just now over the last several months that I've become somewhat consistent. And that's really a first in a very long time. The last time I was really consistent on the channel was maybe 20, 2015, 2016. But uh, I'm definitely back at it now. It feels really, really good. get this on lock and I'm able to really become consistent on YouTube, then I'll consider doing something on Twitch. Baby steps. Baby steps. switch last item for tonight's video is going to be zipper the snake he's such a good boy look how happy he is let's let's focus in on him i learned since the last video that i have to put my hand here come on okay maybe not smile. Just look at Zipper the snake. Little smile. <laughs> look at him. Okay. Zipper is a nice snake. Some snakes are bad. Some snakes want to bite you. Not Zipper the snake. Zipper the snake just wants you to relax.
let's get some separations for the snake. In case you want your own zipper the snake, well, I don't know if they sell them anymore, but I got my zipper the snake at a Hobby Lobby. So check your Hobby Lobby. I know some people were asking me where I got this. I got it at Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby, Hobby Lobby. I got him at Lobby, Hobby Lobby. of Florida, and 
I studied mechanical engineering and I minored in physics at the University of Florida. And that's where I met Olivia at the University of Florida. And then I uh, worked in Panama City, Florida for a co-op or internship experience for three semesters. And then I went back to school to fi finish my final year. And then I moved to Cleveland, Ohio for my job. I worked in the welding industry. I worked for a welding company, a company that makes welding uh, stuff welding equipment and uh, I was a sales engineer there I was uh, the position was called technical sales and I like sales um, it um, took me out of my comfort zone uh, it made my communication a lot better because you're constantly talking to people it made me a more well-rounded person but anyway, so I lived in Cleveland, Ohio for nine months. And then I moved out here to California uh, for my job. Um, as you know, I no longer work at my job. I just do YouTube now. And um, I will be moving back to Florida since I don't have to be here for work anymore. I'll be moving back to Florida here in the next few months. So my time here in California is coming to an end and I'm going back home. I don't know where in Florida I'm gonna live yet. It partially depends on where Olivia can land a job. But um, yeah, <sighs> been moving a lot. It's stressful to move. It's a lot of work, but I'm excited to get back home California is nice. I like California. Uh, last week, me and Olivia, it was our three-year anniversary, and we decided to spend a few days for our to celebrate our three-year anniversary, and we went to San Francisco. Such a cool city. I had never been to a city like San Francisco. So cool. Really, really enjoyed it. We went to Alcatraz, and uh, we had a bunch of really good food in different parts of the city. Uh, we just had a blast. It was a really good time. I don't know why well, I'm telling you I'm not going anywhere with this. I'm just kind of giving you a little update on my life. Oh. Um, but yeah, so within the next few months, I'll be moving back to Florida. Um. I live in Central California right now, uh, the Central Valley, the Central Valley. I've been to LA a couple times to watch some boxing there. Uh, what's the stadium there that I've been to? It's called um, Dignity Health Sports Center. I've watched a couple boxing fights there. I love boxing. I'm a big boxing fan. Watch Tyson Fury versus Deontay Wilder too. Uh, what was it last week? Maybe the week before. What a great fight! Really happy for Tyson Fury. Um, and of course, I hope Deontay Wilder is able to recover and come back strong. You know, you never want to see someone, you know, be permanently affected in the ring. It's all about sport at the end of the day. But I think he's okay. Um, Alright, that's it for my ramble. I'm not going anywhere with it. <laughs> I hope that you enjoyed tonight's video. I hope that the gentle sounds were pleasant to you. And I hope that you were able to find some level of relaxation and peace with tonight's video. But, uh, yeah, that's all I have for tonight. I hope that you have noticed we've been pretty consistent on the YouTube channel here for several weeks now. It's good. It's not perfect, but we're working towards
towards being better, right? I'm always trying to better myself. Anyway, I hope that you have a wonderful night, and I hope that you are able to get some sleep, and I shall see you in the next video. Bye.